Normally you meet a crowd of people and you think one of them's going to be a f***ing <laughs> <laughs> Like the minute you start going like, what are you a lesbian? Then, uh, oh, what, are they, yeah. what do they think of me? I mean, they think I'm all right, but they've already been like, he has said some things that are like... No, they've not. They honestly have. Where I'm from, it's, it's very banterish. <laughs> she's intelligent, she's funny, she's crazy. Almost a girl version of me, really. It's what do you think fun. my friends are going to be like? Lesbians. <laughs> It's my birthday, you <laughs> That was exhilarating. <laughs> oh, sorry, mate, I forgot about you. <laughs> oh, that's nice. From Essex, so I'm assuming. That is 99, you know, Essex, isn't it? Shut up, Essex. You like this place? Yeah, I do, yeah. <laughs> what would you have picked if you'd chosen in terms of venue? Um, I imagine like a strip club if it was you. Actually, you know what? That would have been funny. Bear in mind, you're all lesbians. <laughs> I think you lot might have appreciated that or not. I don't know. Like, it's not necessarily. I would have got nice. Limits. I would have got like. Um, it's crazy. Why do you think we're all lesbians? Why do I think you are? Yeah. Because you are, isn't it? You've just got to be careful with what you're saying. Like, the minute you start going like, what, you're a lesbian, then... Uh, oh, what, are they, what do they think that's of me, gonna turn, That's going to turn off. I mean, they think I'm all right, but they've already been like, he has said some things that are like... No, they've not. They honestly have. Where I'm from, it's, it's very banterish. Like, you just got to stop calling them, like, birds, ladies... What do they call them, mate? Yeah, just call them mate. All right, mate? Yeah, yeah. How yeah, you doing? Yeah, yeah. Nice to meet you. All right, Sam, how you doing? Nice to meet you, yeah. How, how do you know each other? Ollie used to date my sister. Really? Yeah. Where are you from? Yeah. Mark. Mark. London. And you grew up in Essex? I grew up in London. James! James! They all like your voice. They think you're really? sexy and husky. I know, keep telling me. <laughs> I mean, your friend over there, the big one with a husky voice, my God! <laughs> <laughs> it was quite good that we all come together and met different types of people. I'm a plasterer by trade, so when I work, I don't really get to meet different lot of people how I've met today. I think you've got to be a bit thick-skinned and you can't expect everybody to call you by the right name. Yeah. If I went, like, hello, girls, I, I would call you girls, personally. So I work on people's houses and stuff like that. I genuinely do go up and I'm, hello, love, how are you? And that is how I would approach. Yeah. It can be quite, like, challenging to, like, explain to people, like, what type of person you are and why you are the way you are. What would be the right thing to say? So you're educating us a little bit. Yeah, well, I mean, I guess like it's normally good just not to guess with people. So we'll start off with saying like, hello. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> hello, woman. Hello. hello. Or person. Oh, just, Me hello. Man. just hello. No? Just hello. No, 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 it's got to be hello. something human. Yeah, human, there you go. Yeah. Obviously, talking to someone like Chloe, who's like a lovely, lovely girl lady, you know, they might look at a certain word from someone like myself uh, not rude, but it makes them feel, like, uncomfortable. He's the biggest guy in the village, right? Hey. <laughs> what do you know? Fair the competition right now. She's the only guy in the village. Can we, can we all queer each other? <laughs> Come on. Yeah. Favourite part of the night for me was meeting people that I would never have met before. Yeah, exactly the same. But I'm glad I've met you because I've always struggled with gender fluidity. I've never understood yeah. it. Yeah. But That's meeting fine. you and hearing you talk about it. Good. So I've got trans friends, yeah. but I've never met anyone that's gender fluid. Yeah. Just, yeah. In particular, people that are gender fluid. I've never understood gender fluidity until tonight. Yeah. Gender is technically, it's a spectrum. There's not, there's male and female at either end. Yeah. And then people can be anywhere along yeah. there. So I'm neither, I'm in the middle, I'm non-binary. Yeah. Quite often when I meet, not to stereotype, but people like him, you tend to shut down the conversation on both sides. Usually from them, they would expect that I'm going to come on to them or that I'm some kind of weird freak. And from me, I'm like, you're probably going to beat me up. Yeah, you, you don't you to yourself No, not at all. Not in any way, shape or form. I'm not racist or homophobic at all. I mean, I could get on with anyone. It doesn't yeah. bother me what they yeah. look like. Well, that's, they are. Nice that's what I'm I think if somebody does that, they get it towards them. It's because they've got a problem with themselves. They're yeah. insecure. Yeah. 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 He knew what he wanted to ask and it would come straight out. I don't mean to be rude. Oh, no, you're not at all. Like, yeah, we're, yeah, we're having a chat, that's what yeah. We were able to just sit and have a really casual, polite conversation where he was asking questions and he was listening to the answers, which is kind of all you need, really. To be honest with you, I think that it's a conversation that can be talked about amongst people, amongst 
different kinds of genders. If you said, why have you called me that, and started to unravel the reasons why, that, yeah, it might that, be talked that, about more. Yeah, that person would be like, hang on a minute, well, I don't actually know why. The only way someone would offend me is if they was truly trying to offend me, and then if I, but I'd know if they was. Yeah. Do you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a difference. It's like if someone comes up to you and says yeah. something to you, like, and it might be wrong, yeah, but, they, but I can see in their eyes and their heart yeah. that they're genuinely yeah, yeah. like not. I don't think Joe was. I totally agree with that. Happy birthday to you! I didn't know you could blow that good. <laughs> <laughs> As I got chatting, especially to Mark, like as soon as I started chatting to Mark, he was like the most like tender soul. He's like really into yoga, he's into cooking, he's got a dash and it's been an interesting evening in that sense because we've had some really good conversation where like someone might be from a different background, a different area, a different whatever, and words could be taken in the wrong context. I don't think we necessarily like occupy like the same kind of clubs and spaces, but um, if it was like another joint event, if Rachel was like come out with the lads, I'd be like, all right. What do you guys? What do you guys think of me? What's been your verdict? What do you reckon? We love you. Yeah. We love you. Yeah. 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 We love you. My like, friends thought you was the bollocks. Did they? Yeah. <laughs> I thought you was great. I thought you was the nuts. She's like the kill yeah. version of you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Brilliant. Beautiful. Really good time.